till it gets soft. That's this fruit should have some give to it. So when I pick this, you're gonna immediately see all of this sap that comes out from the branch and the fruit. This is very sticky, like glue. This is what original chewing gum was made with. This sap. So sapodilla. Sapodilla. Yes. <laughs> Huh? What are you going to use the chewing gum? No, <laughs> original chewing gum. Uh, now you're chewing on plastic if you're not Ooh, buying natural chewing gum. Tell them. So, yeah, tell yummy, em. right? So, you let this. Now, what we do, tell we have them, a cool, boo. very simple but effective uh, method for collecting these. When we go collect a bunch of sapodilla, we go around with a bucket of water, pick them, and throw them in the water. This sap all leaches out and you don't get it on you. After an hour, you can pull it out, put it on your counter. It's been washed and it's ready to sit there and ripen. Okay, any questions? Amazing. You guys, look at how tiny. No? They, okay. they are, are originally teeny tiny. So cool. Look at that, sapodilla. Also known as nispero. Also known as chico. It has like 20 different names. But for sure, Nispero. Some people call these sapotes. I don't know why. We're at Fruit and Spice Park, guys. Welcome to the tour.